In this video I'll be unboxing the Sharkoon T9 Value Edition case. This is one of the cases from Sharkoon, who are mainly a fan manufacturer, however they've started doing some cases, and this is extremely good value for what you get. This case only costs £47 here in the UK, and has lots of advanced features, some of which can be seen here. So on the front here you can see we have a picture of the case, 9 five and a quarter inch bays, however you have to remove the fans if you want to use more than three of these. You've got a mesh front panel for um, good ventilation. This is also fully dust filtered. Cable management built in. And quick fasteners which allow you to insert and remove optical drives and hard drives without having to deal with screws. Which is really nice. So it's quite a big box, but and for the case this is a fantastic price. So this is the black version, which is a completely black case, black inside and non-LED fans. However, you can also get red, green and white versions which are all black case, however the colour defines the colour of the quick fasteners for the drives, the motherboard tray and the blanking plates, as well as the colour of the LEDs in the fan. The black version which I have here does not have LED fans, just normal fans. So let's open up this box and see what we get. So, cut that and that and then let's open. So this motherboard, this case supports ATX and Micro ATX motherboards. Let's see as we open the box. You can see the case going in from the top, looks very nice. That's as far as you, much you can tell in the bag. So now get it out. So a good trick for getting a case out of the box is to tip it upside down. Like this. Oops. <laughs> Here's the wrapping inside there. Undo that. Okay, and then just lift the box off. Okay, so here we have the case, wrapped in polystyrene, so we can do it. Got a shock of polystyrene there, and there we go. So, polystyrene come off and go over there, and then put the case out. One of the reasons I, I was in, saw this case and thought it was really interesting is you get lots of really premium features in a really cheap case. So you get an all painted interior, cable management, as well as front USB 3. So, get this out of the bag, so. There's nothing in the bag in there. Yeah, awesome. So good. Okay, so the first thing we see in here is some. I guess just saying the manual is available on their website if you need it. But for a case you don't really usually need it. So here in the front of the thing, they'll be doing a full review of this later, so you're not really going to see much, but you've just got. You know, your ports, USB 3 as well, that's nice. Nice mesh front panel, you've got power and reset switches. Side, you've got a nice large window, which I'll clean off. There we go. I'll stick it back on just. Um, yeah. On the back of the case, you can see you've got your back fan here, which has rubber mounts to prevent vibration. Expansion bays, which are vented, as well as your cable for USB 3. So you will have to run this cable out the back of the case and connect it in. However, I did find Scan UK have an adapter that allows you to connect this, like a regular USB 3 connection, into your motherboard's header. So you could buy one of them and use it. So that's nice. So there are accessories inside, so I'll quickly take a look and see what you get. So first thing is these thumb screws are really nice. They are actually got rubber around them, so it makes it really nice and easy to grip them. So that's them removed and just see what what accessories we get. This thing just comes off. Oh. And we'll put the side panel over there. Okay, so in here we've got all your, all your cables and stuff. And we have a nice large box of accessories. So, see what accessories we get with this. I'll take a look at them in a minute. A uh, vented front panel for your 3.5 inch bay adapter. Which should have probably been in this bag but it's fallen out. And yeah, so I'll just take a quick look at the accessories you get with it, and so we'll be right back. Okay, so I'm going to take a quick look at the accessories you get that come with this case. So you've obviously got this vented front panel I showed earlier, allowing you to connect three and a half inch external drives. And then you've got this little box, so I'll just take a look in here. Just 
tip and open it up. Okay, so there's a lot of hardware that we get here, so a little bag of screws, washers, motherboard standoffs, quite nice to get. These, which I'll have to talk about in a minute, there's a lot of them. More screws, quite lots of interesting little ones. A speaker, yes! I love getting these, because the case doesn't have a speaker, and I like getting a sus a, some way to make the system do post beeps, because if there is a problem, you can usually diagnose them. And I like the way they're actually giving these separately, because you could actually use this in other systems if there is one without a speaker and you need to diagnose a problem, so that's nice to get. That's nice. Lots of little cable ties, which is nice. As well as these things. Now the reason you get these is because in this case you can remove all the fans and install nine five and a quarter inch drives. So to install hard drives you need to use these little brackets which just attach onto your hard drives and then slide into five and a quarter inch bay. So it's a bit of a pain, not the best thing in the world however, it's absolutely fine because you can mount your drives, slide them in and then use your regular screwless connect adapters to connect them in. There's also a little metal doohickey, if we describe that. Not sure what that is, so it'll be interesting to see what that is. But, yeah, so that's the accessories. So, I'm going to obviously start doing a review of this, I'll build a PC into it and we'll have a look and see what the case is like. So, stand by for that. It'll probably be out around about the same time as this video because I'll obviously have to get the PC up and running before I can edit both of them. Okay, so thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe for more videos. And you can also visit our website at review-this.org.